It's going to take something different. It's going to take more of my time. Giving up more of my time. I've, I've got to read my Bible more. I've got to pray more. I'm going to have to fast more than I used to. And that's that's a hard thing to do for me. Because I like to eat. I don't know about you guys. I like to eat. And that's a hard thing for me to do. But you know, uh, how bad do we want it? I said it right there. How bad do you want it? Yes, I used to have a coach and he would tell us, he said, how bad do you want this? How bad do you want to go out there for you? Well, it's up to you. It's up to us. Amen. Praise God. God is good to us. He loves us and takes care of us. It's good to see Team Challenge here tonight. I know that you guys have been busy. Had a busy, uh, busy Christmas. You guys have a great Christmas? Yeah. All right. Praise God. Been out there working at college still, I know. And, uh, uh, that'll be over about Thursday night, I guess. That'll be the last of the morning. Right. Okay. I know you guys are going to be glad to get out of that cold. Get out of the cold. Back in the war. Let's pray and ask God to have his way tonight. We love you, Lord, and we thank and praise you for every blessing. I thank you, God, because you challenge our hearts, Father. We know, God, that you want to you want to pour your blessings upon your children, Father. I know that you do, Lord. That you care and you want to give good gifts, Lord, just like we want to give gifts to our children. God, we know that it's going to take obedience on our part, Lord, to do what we need to do. We just pray for strength. We pray for guidance. Lord, I, I just thank you today, Father, for the opportunity to be in this service tonight, Father. And Lord, I pray that, uh, Lord, whatever needs are here tonight in this, in this auditorium, in every life and every heart, Father, that your Holy Spirit would search us. Search the innermost being of our, our hearts, Lord, of our spirits, of our minds, Father. And divide it, Father, God. Cut it, Father. Cut it. Cut deep into us, Lord, we pray. Speak to our hearts tonight. Help us to know, Father, that it's your voice that's speaking to us, Lord. We just pray for the anointing upon this service and everything that's done and said tonight, Lord. We pray and ask it in Jesus' name. Everybody say amen. 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 Amen.
love you, Father, Lord, we love you, Jesus. To love you, Father, Lord, we love you. Lord, we love you, Father. Praise your name. After you got out of TCMI, we got married. The only thing that we had, because I lived at home still, and I didn't want to take anything that my mom had. That I had at my mom's. I didn't want to take anything from her house. Because just in case it didn't work out, I knew I wanted everything just like it was. So I could go back. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. But you know what? I'm serious. I'm just kidding. No, I'm not. I am serious. So, But you know what? When we got married 13 years ago, all we had, I had a car. And Pastor had a blue couch. That someone gave him a TCMI that he brought back to Shafter with him. And you know what? We are no millionaires at all. But I'm telling you, we had 49. And I don't know why I'm telling you this. What I'm trying to, I don't know why I'm telling you. Somebody needs to know this that God can do miracles still today. Amen. When we got married, he had filed income tax for almost eight years. So we had at least about $5,000 hanging over our head about there. We had child support. We also had back child support. Was that better? It was